my name is Deb McNaughton and today I'm going to show you how to paint a glass mural. So if you look behind me, that is the window I will be painting and it's going to take approximately two days. It's 14 square metres and I hope you enjoy this video. So one of the first things I do before I even think about painting is I use a program called Procreate to design my concept and come up with my colours and a plan. So I'll show you my design for this mural right now. do is clean the window and get ready to prepare it with the undercoat. What to do is to tape the window with painter's tape in order to protect the outside of the window that we don't want paint on. The next step in the process is to apply a plastic acrylic undercoat. I'm going to be doing two coats of this before I start applying my colour. Now I have done two base coats on the window and now I'm at the stage of adding my colour. So I'll be using interior house paints just from my local hardware store and I'll be applying them with a roller. today and then I'll think about wrapping up and returning tomorrow to do more details. Hello, I'm back here for day two of mural painting. Yesterday I painted for around about seven and a half hours and my arm before, um, but that's all part of the fun and today I'm going most of my work was done using a roller whereas today now that I'm doing the finer details I'm using these fat brushes and smaller brushes like these so I'm just gonna continue on and um, get this job done As you can see behind me, I'm well and truly on the home stretch now. So I'm just filling in a couple of green bits along the bottom and then the fiddly little annoying bits um, and second coats of colour. Um, I finished with the paints and all the colourful stuff. If you look at my original design, you can see I've strayed away from it a little bit and changed a couple of things as I've gone, but it's pretty much the same. Uh, so the next step is to seal it with a clear gloss sealant that will protect it from the weather and the rain. And then I'll be peeling off the tape and then I'll be finished. The very last step is to remove the tape 
which I am about to do now, and then the mural is complete. <laughs>